Hey everyone, it's Sam here, and today I'm going to make an update video on all my dolls. This has been a long requested video, and some of my dolls are in their PJs, because they wanted to have a pajama party. <laughs> so, um, my last video was 12 minutes long that I made of this, so YouTube wouldn't take it, so I'm going to try to make it short. So I'm going to say um, their name, what doll they are, and when I got them, and how I got them. Okay, so my first doll was Jacqueline Nicole. Um, I got her in Christmas of 2003. She was my first doll, and she's just lucky number 23. The next doll I got, her name is Abigail Cecilia Amanda, and um, I got her from my cousin in 2000, summer of 2004, and she used, she's just like me, number 12, or she looks a lot like Gwen. She used to have bangs like these, and I missed those, but when I sent her to the doll hospital to get her fixed, she came back with these, and I don't like them that much, but whatever. <laughs> um, the next doll I got was Kate Lily. I got her with Abigail. Um, she, they are both from my cousin. Um, they were in the basement, they were in her basement in Florida, and they had been in a lot of water from Hurricane Katrina, so she gave them to me, and they, their eyes were rusted. Um, she's a Pleasant Company Samantha, and she is from the first year that American Girl came out, along with her. Um, and her hair is short. I don't like it that much, so I'm thinking about rewigging her. She's in a wheelchair because she can't stand. The next one I got was Marisol Alejandra Luna. Um, <laughs> uh, she is Girl of the Year 2005. I got her for my birthday. Um, I really wanted to get her in Chicago, but I was, oh, I really couldn't afford her. So my grandma surprised me and got her for me. Um, I love her. You can do anything with her hair, and I recently sent her to the doll hospital. Um, I got her November 2004. The next one I got was Jess. She doesn't have a middle name. Um, her hair is a little bit shorter because it got matted at the end. Um, I got her for my, I think, Christmas in 2006, either Christmas or my birthday. Um, she's cute. Um, you can't really do much with her hair. I just don't like the composition of her, but I have almost all the girls of the year, so it wouldn't make sense to sell her. The next doll I got is Nikki Carolyn Fleming, and she is adorable. I love her. If you have the chance to get her, you need to get her. Um, she is my mini lookalike for now, I think, besides Lucy. Um... I love her. Um, I got her for my birth, well, actually, when I got home from camp in 2007, which was July, no, June. Yeah, I got her in June when I came home from camp, so that was, like, the 14th, I believe. Um, yeah. The next one I got was Rebecca Rubin. Um, I renamed her Becky. Um, I love her. I got her in 2008 when she first came out. Uh, she was a welcome home from camp present, too. I got her June 14th, so they both share the same birthday, except they're a year apart. Um, I grew out of American Girl in 2008, so I didn't really want Becky, but my grandma gave her to me anyway. So I didn't really play with her that much. That's why her curls are still really nice. So, yeah, a year goes by here. Now it's summer 2009. I find Lucy in the pawn shop. Oh my gosh, that was the best day ever. It was a year after she was retired, and she, she was in perfect condition. $50. So I'm like, oh my goodness, I need to get her. And she is my look like when I have green eyes, or hazel eyes, because I have hazel eyes, and they can turn green and blue. So, And when I straighten my hair, it's kind of reddish. So I love her, and if you find her for cheap like I did, you need to get her. The next one I got was Kaylee Marie, or Kaylee Hope. Kaylee Marie Hope. <laughs> Um, I absolutely adore her. Her blonde hair and brown eye composition is adorable. And I love how you can part her hair and... What are you doing? Sorry. <laughs> um, I bought her for my friend in 2009. I think it was just before school started. Um, she was $65 plus 13 outfits, and I thought that was really cheap, except she really wasn't $65 because I had to add another 50 to send her to the doll hospital because her hair was cut up to there and came around and swooped down there. So yeah. The next doll I got, her name is Brooklyn. Uh, she doesn't have a middle name. I think she's historical Molly, or just like me. I couldn't, I couldn't really tell because I got her at a garage sale for $35. Um, she's cute and kind of has a pointy head, and she is 
pleasant company, so I think she's Molly. She doesn't fit into any shoes, so that's kind of a problem, and she's hard to put, put into outfits. Um, the next girl I got, her name is Emily Magdalene Clara Dean, or just Emmy. <laughs> um, I love her. I don't know what number she is. Right there. Hey, <laughs> I got her for my birthday. I paid for her. It was either the option of her or the Just Like Me with caramel hair and blue eyes. Um, they didn't have the Just Like Me as caramel hair in stock, so I got her instead, and I'm so glad I didn't choose the other doll, because she is adorable. And a little tip for her, if you pick out some of her layers, you can give her side bangs without cutting anything, but it's really hard to put, put all the layers back, but, yeah. The next doll I got is Blake Holland. Um, I don't think she has a middle name yet either, but, um, I do not like the name Lainey, that's why I renamed her Blake, and I went to the American Girl Place Atlanta on January 1st with my best friend, Zach Efron Fan 2277, and we both got Lainey together. Um, she named hers Alex. Please subscribe to her right here. Alright, um, she's adorable. I love her, but there's this weird curl right here. It's really weird compared to the rest of her hair. Um, she looks cute in any outfit, and I love her side bangs. And a fun fact about her is I swear I could have requested her. Like, I'm like, hey, let last year in 2009, we're like, hey, why don't you make a doll with blonde curly hair, side bangs, and hazel eyes? Because I, I think I looked like her at one point. And they're like, sorry, we cannot take customer requests or whatever, so. Yeah, it was just really weird. And sure enough, here she is. The next doll I got is Erin. Um, she's adorable. Her hair is a little bit shorter because my brother got into the scissors and cut off some hair. So I was able to fix it, and I think I did a pretty good job. I mean, it's even, and it looks good. It doesn't look even right here because her hair is pulled back, but I really want to re-wig her, re -wig her because I loved her long hair. Um, she is number 24, I think. I'm not sure, but she's really cute, and you should get her and keep her long hair and keep scissors away from your brother. I got her February 19th, 2010. The next doll I got was Cinnamon Malone. Um, I was thinking about renaming her Glozelle because... Glozell's video on videos on YouTube are the best. Okay, <laughs> so but I decided not to, and I'll, I got her when I went to California. I forgot what date that was, but that's where I ran into AG Love Jess. Um, if you get her, prepare for fizzy hair. So what you're gonna do is mist her hair and then kind of just pat it down, so it keeps it less frizzy. You can't really do much with her hair, but she's so precious and cute. And the final but not least doll I got was Lindsay. Um, I'm just borrowing her. We, Me and my friend Maddie, we traded dolls for a little bit. I traded her my Lacey, just like me, number 21, I think. Um, Lindsay's adorable. I'm going to steam her curls so I can so her hair is really curly. And I love her. She looks a lot like Jacqueline, and I love the side bangs. So, yeah, those are all my dolls, over and out. That was Glozelle.